Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Shadow back again with another YouTube video. Hit the like, hit the comment, and hit the subscribe button. We've got a couple projects I'm working on over here. Follow God first and foremost, man. Too much negativity out here. All right, <clears throat> so long story short, this video is going to be about, um, all right, so this is the Roland BN28. Um, I want to see if you can use, like, what what type of transfer, because you know you got to put the transfer paper, not the transfer, but the carrier paper, the little plastic sheets over top. So I'm trying to see what's the most economical way. Like, recently I found out you can continue to reuse the same transfer, uh, <clears throat> transfer uh, sticker paper. So I'm just gonna see uh, what's the most like cost efficient method. I bought a brand from Amazon. Um, that brand, I'm gonna use that brand in a little bit once I cut to the to the to the next scene. And also, I'm gonna be using regular vinyl, like you know, you know what I'm saying, like the regular vinyl for T-shirts. I'm gonna use that little sticky, the sticky stuff on the back of that, and see if I can use that for this. Because I can say, I mean, we all can save a lot of money because <coughs> them little vinyl transfers. The little sticky papers are expensive. All right. All right, y'all. So I'm back again. I got my tripod set up. All right. So cool. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be doing a hat. I'm going to be doing my shorts, another pair of shorts, and a t-shirt. So here we go. We got it. This is going to be for the t-shirts, like size 12 inches wide. And this is going to be for the shorts, two shorts, and one hat. I hope it, I hope it worked. I don't know. It should work. Let's see if it work, y'all. We're gonna take it over here. Yeah, that look like it might be alright. Might be alright. So we're gonna put that back. Alright, so we're gonna do this for real. Now I know I might be messing up somebody's trade secrets, but man, I ain't gonna lie. This is straight out the package. This is 20 bucks. Um, this is just an experiment. All right, so I'm gonna do one of them. I'm gonna do one of them, like. Or should I do this big one? Yeah, I'm gonna do this big one with this. I'm all right. Y'all see this? I'm gonna use the big one. Use this one for the big joint. All right. All right. Cool. Here we go. I mean, it ain't nothing but sticker paper. We gonna, but we gonna see though. We gonna see if it's nothing but sticker paper. Yeet. Uh, brand from I don't want to give the links out or nothing like that because they're not sponsoring me but basically um, it said that I have to use a specific type of uh, a specific specific type of transfer paper in order for this thing to work so I'm gonna see if this regular transfer paper works the stuff from Amazon I'm gonna just peel it up See if that stuff works. And my subscribers are here with me. Just to let you know, I'm not trying to scam nobody. And I'm not getting paid sponsorship, even though I do want some sponsorship. So if you guys know anybody that needs some sponsoring, hey, I'll make some videos for you, okay? Okay. All right, and this is just the regular, just the regular stuff from um, like a regular sheet of vinyl, like stalls or cricket you know what i'm saying or the little cheap amazon stuff i'm gonna just see how this works i'm gonna just see if it works all right hopefully i can get that to cover the whole thing i might have to do this like <clears throat> let's see i might have to use two at a time i thought i could use a little sticky paper that comes from the uh, heat transfer vinyl for vinyl t-shirts. All right, so that's one. We got two. Once again, this is the heat transfer vinyl, like regular Degla, nothing fancy. We got two. And um, matter of fact, I'm gonna just dig in the trash can. We're just gonna go in the trash can and I'll see what's in there. So, all right. Here go number three. I'm gonna dug in the trash can. Dang, my tripod messing up. That trash is stuck to it. See, I don't see my videos are fake. Trash is stuck on it. Nasty. 
straight out the trash bin and back into the trash bin. All right, so y'all, we're gonna do it like this. We're gonna do this one like that. We're gonna do this one like this. All right. My back is hurting. I need the chair when I make these, these videos. All right, so this one is just regular vinyl paper. This one is the Amazon $20. What do they call it, man? Transfer tape for pattern printed heat transfer. Button. All right, just the transfer tape. All right, so on first release, what do we got? What do we have going on here? First release, uh-oh, it's not sticky enough. Let's peel it real slow. <laughs> sticking yeah that's it's coming up a little bit but let's see but I, I do believe that's from me not um, that's from me not squeezing the joint good enough but we gonna see we definitely gonna see. Now that's one. I think if I would have squeegeed it a little better, it would have stuck, but. All right. All right, so that's one. Make sure I squeegee this. Get the bubbles out. Make sure the bubbles are out. See, the t-shirt vinyl stuff is not sticky enough. I think. I don't think it's sticky enough. Not sticky enough. But if you in the crunch time, I mean, if you run out of your transfer paper, I mean, I mean, your transfer tape, I mean, ooh, that's kind of nasty. That is nasty. Look at it, y'all. You gotta peel it real slow for this to work. Peel it real slow for this to work. Cause it's not giving me those, those results that I'm looking for, okay? <coughs> so the verdict is in. My curiosity has peaked. No, I mean, yeah, you can. But as you see, as you see, that paper is not sticky enough. If it was a little more stickier, then you can use it. This is this is like a low tack, like a very low tack. And that's the uh, regular, just the back of the stuff from the vinyl, like the uh, Cricut, heat transfer stalls heat transfer uh <coughs> vinyl rolls all right cool so we got three we managed to get three hopefully the heat once i put apply heat to it is good but then so far the frisco tape that's working good it's very sticky and that's working way better than that all right so let's see here see if i can set my um set my joint up set my tripod up here settings are at 333 degrees for uh, 15 seconds high heat and since I don't know this release um, usually I always do like a cool pill always do a cool pill and then um, a heat press it again for like another another five or ten seconds all right so it's looking nice looking perfect Looking good, looking good. Four fingers, okay. Four fingers down. That looks like it's centered. All right, so we're just gonna spank that jump. Spank that jump on for 15 seconds. 
like that's the high pressure right there. It's the high pressure. Let's see what we got. I'm gonna set this off to the side because this is gonna be a cold pill. Look at that cold pill. Alright, so now we got these two. These two, remember, these are from the, the regular heat press. No, the regular like transfer, t shirt transfer material. I got this from Amazon. And I'm gonna put it on a pair of shorts. <coughs> Just a regular Dagla pair. A little sleeper pair. All right, it's looking all right. It looks okay. Okay, yeah. So, it should be about time for this t-shirt to come up from the cold peel. So I could do my other press. So this is where it gets tricky, y'all. Let's see, this is the moment of truth. It's the moment of truth and you peel that edge down off. Yes, it's looking good. Looking really good. Looking real good. Hey, all this. I found a new uh, transfer tape. <laughs> I'm gonna keep buying that Frisco tape because for one, it's, it's 20 bucks. For two, it's 20 bucks. For three, you can reuse the same stuff over and over again. So that's, I mean, I might run out. That Frisco tape might take me about a year to run out. All right, and that's, yeah, that's in there. All right, so here go number two. This is the, um, the, uh, the vinyl roll. This came from this pink vinyl roll. We're gonna see what, what it do. It's feeling good, man. It's feeling real good. It's not, it's feeling good, man. It's feeling good. That's all I'm gonna say, it's feeling good. It's good. Now I am new to the rolling BN20. Uh, this video is somebody new like myself to this whole, you know, vinyl printing, using transfer tape and things like that. But I'm telling you, you can use, like, like you know what I'm saying? I'm showing you. You can use the, the tape from the vinyl rolls. Cricket, a Caesar stalls, you can use those. All right, this is number three. And of course, it's gonna do the same thing number two did. It's number three. It was on there good. Got the heavy pressure. Everything was good. All right. There we go. Everything was good. All right, so I'm just going to fast forward because um, we get the point here. Bottom line, what I would say is that Frisco tape is amazing. <laughs> the uh, vinyl tape. Hey, if you if you if you ain't got no more vinyl tapes left, use it. <laughs> it's looking good. Looking good. All right, now I'm gonna press the hat. Show y'all how the hat looking. Peace. All right, y'all. We are all done. This is made with my machine rolling bn 28 yep 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 follow oh, god this thing is hard real hard um this is going to be posted on my website so if you guys want to purchase feel free to purchase to continue you know continue a positive message <laughs> all right if you got any value out of this this video like comment and subscribe if you get any value out of this channel make sure you share peace